everybody, 47 Mark IV here, back playing Absolute MC Jetty. Oh man, come on, die, yeah. Alright, uh, those are the things that we're gonna have to be watching out for. The flying spiders that shoot block damaging missiles. Awesome. Ooh, they took out a little bit of the wall. Alright, well, oh, hold on a second, let's, uh... Let's fix the trees. Let's fix the trees. Okay, hold on. We got to do this right, right? We got to fill it back in. Hold on. Here we go. Dirt. There we go. A little bit of dirt action. No problem. Hey, you know what? I could do that. There we go. Nice flat lawn. All right. We'll fill the dirt in. No one will ever know that this wasn't a tree. Cool. <laughs> oh, man. I love it. I love it so much. All right, now we've got to, uh, yeah, we're going to have to fill the wall back in with something. I guess you're going to be like this. So I have got to make nicer walls. The zombies can now break these blocks. Uh, let's take a look. Yeah, just like this, right? They now can eat most of the blocks in the game. I do want them to tunnel to get to you. And uh, their spawning is going to be a little bit different since we have hardcore darkness now. Now, it's not complete hardcore darkness i did give you a moonlight but it's still gonna be pretty dark all right so plan of the day today plan of the day is to try to improve storage a little bit uh if you've noticed i've been digging out back here a little bit and i've decided to use some friends to help me dig right here the creep cube so i think what i'm going to do is make myself a storage room and I think I've got room to go this way, maybe. It doesn't really matter. I think this is 13 right here. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven should be the middle, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, right here. So this block should be the middle. And for a creep cube, right? Sneak right click, repeat last action, which is flatten an area. So here's what I'm going to do is let's get let's get a bunch of these dudes going i don't know four yeah that's four is the maximum now i don't want to stand directly where they are because i am going to get eaten by the Gru if i do that <laughs> i need to let them do their thing but we can't get too far because i'm a little afraid they're going to get into the next building uh, so let's see. And I don't. Oh no! Perfect. Perfect. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh man, that was almost bad. They they jumped on the torches like at the last second. All right, let's just take a look. Make sure. Yeah, there we go. And let's not leave any spawnable spaces before I walk away. All right, this should work. I think this is the next building. I don't know. Let's take a look. Hello, iron. Thank you. I'm not 100% sure. All right, let's, uh, well, I guess I could dump a bunch of these garbage blocks back here. I just don't want to leave a big void, right, for things to spawn in. But we're going to change a lot of these blocks anyways, because, you know, this looks like garbage, right, compared to the rest of the base. And I do need to raise this ceiling up right here, but, you know, we'll make it nice. All right. So let's take care of all of those problems along with storage. Man, oh, I got to put away my creep missiles. Let's take care of a lot of these problems. Uh, you are garbage. All right, number one, storage. So storage is going to be drawers, right? And drawers are pretty easy. I need to make a bunch of pistons. You've seen drawers before. Uh, you know, let's make, I guess we'll grab a little bit of this wood here. And we'll make some basic drawers just so I can start putting things away, right? So here we go. Uh, what do I want for drawers, right? What do we want for drawers? I never really liked the acacia drawers. Two orange. Spruce isn't bad. Birch isn't bad. Jungle is actually kind of good looking in this, uh, in this texture pack. So you know what I might do here is I might put this oak away and let's grab jungle wood here. Yeah, let's do this. And I'll get myself a bunch of stacks of that. And right here, there we go. Gonna get some basic drawers. And you know, I probably need more. I probably need more. But this is just to get us kind of started, right? Just so we can see all of our options. All right, so that gets me 16 of these drawers. And I'll make compacting drawers and other drawers, you know, soon enough. All right, so we got 16 drawers, but what we really need is this guy right here the drawer controller 
So diamond, cook stone. Uh, you are regular stone and sticks and quartz. Okay, we can do this. Right, here's some quartz. And am I out of sticks? No, I was going to say, I can't be out of sticks, right? And let's grab some red stone. And let's see, we needed regular stone. And I have this feeling like I needed cobblestone somewhere. I'm not sure. All right, so let's grab uh, six redstone torches. Hello, redstone torch, right? So let's grab six of these dudes. And we'll make ourselves... Nope, not that. You're a compacting drawer. Let's make ourselves... Oh, that's right. So I did put this in here for you so you can swap them directly. Uh, drawer controller. So we'll make two of those dudes. And, oh yeah, the one diamante. Need to make one of these. Here you go. And drawer controller. All right. So let's do this. Let's come back here. And, you know, I'll do my drawer controller. Uh, I think... Let me think about this. Drawer controller... You can be anywhere for right now. For right now. I'm going to put you right there. And then we'll slap down, you know, a bunch of our drawers that are touching it. And you know what I'm going to do is... Oh, I got a, such a good plan. Uh, this is going to be off on size. But, you know, I'm going to fill this all in. All right. So I'm going to do it like that. Uh, am I going to do it like that? Am I going to do it like this? Uh, you know what? I need to take out one more. Ah, I got to make an axe. I accidentally veined mine with the axe that I had made in between episodes, and now I don't have an axe. And I just like to have one. I, I know it takes a second, but I just like to have one. Go ahead, make me an axe. Thank you very much. All right, so we got all that. So the next thing, I'm going to need some power, right? And I would like to get ourselves the uh, inventory something or other. What do they call this thing? Uh, let's see. Here we go. At RF Tools, right? Let's use some of our RF Tools action. RF Tools. I can't even spell it. Let's see. It is going to be... Oh, yeah. It's a storage, right? So, let's see. It's a storage scanner. That's what it is. Storage scanner. Right there. So, I'm going to need four redstone torches, some gold, and some ender pearls. Well, that's not that hard, right? So, we've got this and this. And I've got extra machine frames here somewhere. There's one of them. And we'll grab some pearls. And let's see, what else do we need for storage scanner? And, oh yeah, it's just going to be two pieces of gold. So this is pretty cheap, right? This is really cheap. And we will get back to the modular storage really shortly. All right, there's four of those. Excuse me. And storage scanner, thank you very much. Yeah, and then this is going to be the power for it, and we will power it with a little bit of charcoal. And you know, you know, we really should get some power storage. We really should. Uh, we'll work on that later, I guess. We'll work on that later. Let's just get this dude working. Yeah, and this is what I was thinking, right? Is I just want to take one more drawer out so and put it right there. Because then I can put my storage scanner right here, and I can put my coal generator on top. And I'll work on better lighting in a second, but, I mean, this doesn't take just anything for energy, right? So this holds 50,000, and I don't know what this thing's going to make, but let's give it, uh, let's give it, like, five more, you know? And then I can start working on, ah, uh, putting stuff away. And I should be able to scan in one block, and we can just see this drawer controller, and I'll make it routable. Done. Right, so this will be the beginning of our storage room. And what we'll do is we'll make ourselves uh, some storage. Yeah, let's, I think we'll do that now. Let's, let's make some storage stuff. So let's see, I want to make some modular storage. So I'm going to need a chest, another quartz. Easy, 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 easy. Yeah, let's do this. All right, so let's grab this stuff. Let's grab these machine frames. Let's grab some of this. And oh, I guess I'm out of regular old redstone. And I'm sure I'm going to need iron. I don't know. What else do I need for modular storage? Chess. Do I have any chess? I feel like I accidentally just put something away. All right. Right here. So modular storage. Uh, for right now, for right now, I'm going to take two. I'm going to take two. And then let's see what we can get uh, for cards. Right? So this is just gold nuggets. Gold nuggets. Oh, I'm getting a little low on gold. Well, we're going to fix that, too. 
They're going to fix that. There we go. And let's see. Let's get some tier one. Oh, I'm going to need going to need more quartz. Well, that's pretty easy right there. Let's get tier one. Hello? Oh, you're up here now. All right. So here's a tier one card, and we'll get a pair of them. Oh, I guess I'm out of chests. I used all the chests that we had. Uh, you know what? No, I don't want to use the oak. I don't want to use the oak. I want to use... Do I have any more jungle? Yes. Let's just fix chests. There we go. Got a whole bunch of them. All right. So there's another tier one. They don't stack, apparently. And, yep. Now I'm just going to spend some more of the gold I don't have. Oh, no, I do have it right there. Blocks of gold. All right, so then we're going to move them up to Tier 2. And let's take a look at Tier 3. Let's take a look. Tier 3 is blocks of gold, blocks of quartz, blocks of redstone. Uh, let's just do it. Let's just spend it. I think we can do it all. Here we go. You. And I'll do it again. All right. All the way up to Tier 3. There we go. Got two Tier 3s. Got two modular storage. All right. Let's go back over here. And... What I think I'm going to do for right now, yeah, I'm going to take this dude out and take that out. Did you hold your inventory? Maybe you went right into my dank null. Like, where did all that cobblestone go? I have a feeling that you, like, instantly went in the dank null, right? Uh, let's see, where is the dank null? Dank null, you're right here. I just want to make sure. So let's do this. Let's, uh, I just want to run a test here. That made me uncomfortable. So I am going to take my one cobblestone. I'll put you in a drawer and oh yep when i started chopping i took it okay cool everything works all right so basic drawer you can go right there and right here right here Ah, uh, this is getting better it's getting better in design all right so there's some modular storage right and we'll put some tier three in there and now i'm going to scan again think you're in a one block radius but let's find out scan two modular storage make you routable and i'm going to move the drawer controller up there we go and then i'm going to remove everybody else there we go so now it can put it in the drawer controller first if not in modular storage and now i can take everything that we had over here and move it right i can dump out all of this stuff that's going to be so handy now, to move some of that stuff, uh, there is a bag that you can use right here, the Ender Sack, which is an Ender Chest, which is Obsidian. And of course, that's the thing I don't have at the moment, but we're totally, totally going to fix that. Ah, the beginning of storage. Now, we're going to need a lot of wood. We got to get to build a wood farm here, a tree farm here very shortly. But yeah, that should work. All right, so next thing. Next thing is... I got to make this look a little bit nice, right? And we have a mod here, building gadgets. And I really want the exchanging gadget because it's pretty cheap. And let's see, you're going to take energy and I think I can charge you. I don't actually know, but we are going to find out. So let's go down here. Let's get the exchanging gadget. Who's got RF left? Nobody. Nobody's got RF. This is why we're going to need... Oh, I got charcoal on me. All right, this is why we're going to need a lot more power. So let's see. Let's see if we can do this. Can I put you in here and I can charge you up? Nice. Now, I have moved a lot of the keybinds in the pack so you can set them, you know, however you want to set them. But here's what I'm thinking. I at least want this place to match a little bit. You are gray hardened clay and the walls are gray as well. Let's see. You are gray concrete. Great concrete. Where did I put you? Oh, I put you right in here. All right, let me get out my folder. Oh, not like that, like this. There we go. I keep putting a torch down. Let me do this. Oh, there we go. And you are all my gray hardened clay. Got it all. Thank you very much. You can go back in there and close. There we go. All right, so building gadget, you are right here and you've got, you know, 60,000, whatever. All right. So let's see. I would like to exchange you. And we've got to look. Range one. All right. Can I do better than that? Mode is wall. Let me check the key binds. Here we go. So let's, uh, let's you know, set our block, right? And let's see. I want to do this as, 
Uh, I guess the, this mode doesn't really matter as much. Here we go. Making the range bigger. I'd at least like to change over the floor, right? Gray hardened clay. So just like this. Boop, boop. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right. So we can get all these dudes changed right out. And there we go. Used all the gray hardened clay that I had. You know, I might change this all out. I don't know. I just kind of wanted to play with the building gadget, right? Because we got to start expanding the base and seemed like a good use for it. You know, maybe we'll make some nicer floors and update the walls and stuff like floor, wall and ceiling all being the same block is kind of blah, right? But this is going to be the beginning of our storage network. Now, we're going to need a ton more wood to get this done. And, you know, that's a, a project for another time. Now, the one last thing that I do want to get done is, oh, man, I'm going to have to put some of this garbage away. I got all kinds of cobblestone doing that. So, uh, you know what? Let's just go ahead. Uh, cobblestone, you can go right there, right? And let's just go ahead, I guess, and start putting some of this stuff right away. Yeah, I like that. All right, the rest of you is good stuff that I will have to figure out. Because like a lot of this, I want to put in compacting drawers. All right, so last thing that I want to do is I want to be able to use this stuff. And I do want to be able to swap back and forth. Yeah, I've been charging this up a little bit. I need to put a little bit more charcoal in here. And we'll see if we can fill this up on air some more. Because what I got to do is go get a bucket of lava or two. I really need lava. And so what I want to do is I want to be able to make a block... Uh, to exchange all of my armor with. So I want to take a look at a mod called Gear Swapper, right? So I can get these blocks right here. Is the model doesn't much matter. It's whatever you can afford, right? So I think, at least that's what I think it is. So I'm going to go ahead and get, do you have to be Dark Oak? No, I have a feeling like you're or dictionary. A chest, a repeater, I mean, or not a repeater, a comparator. Uh, should be pretty easy. All right, what do I do? I got sticks. We've got redstone. I've got quartz here. No, you're marble. I need a little bit of quartz. We're going to need some plain old cooked uh, stone. Let's see, right there, cooked stone. So let's make our, let's make our repeater. No, our comparator. There we go. One, two, three. Right there. And this dude right there. Going to need a chest. And I, yep, oh, I've already got it on me. And then I'm just going to have to pick the block. So I don't know. We'll use this one. I got cooked stone on me. So here we go. That's what it looks like right now. Don't, don't worry about it. All right. So you can put this anywhere. Uh, I need a space where I could probably put a chest over it. I guess I'll pop a little hole in the ceiling. It doesn't much matter. I guess I could put it right here. All right. So this is what it looks like. It gives you four slots. And I do want to go ahead Let's go ahead and put a chest. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do that. Yeah, I guess I can still open it. That works. Oops. <laughs> I wanted to put a torch up there. Thank you. Uh, so here's what I'm going to do is let me just dump off everything that I don't need. All right. So I've cleaned out a little bit more and I want to show you this. All right. So sneak left click to store current setup in a slot. So sneak left click will be right here remembered current hot bar and armor and now if i come down here to settings you can see this is what was on my hot bar and here's my armor right and i can make an icon for this so i'm going to say right there and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to swap into my hazmat suit uh right here and we're going to sneak right click up uh, torches i'm going to sneak right click this one right here uh sneak left click there we go and then I'll go to settings and I'm just going to take this and let's see. And you are right there. You can tell which one it is by which one has the highlighted block. And you can see it says put all of this stuff here. I guess go ahead and put torches in my offhand, right? Like so you could configure this. And now what's going to happen is I've got all of this armor on me. I'm wearing my hazmat suit. Well, if I punch that block, now I'm wearing all of this. And if I want, I can dump all of that stuff in there. And I should be able to swap back and forth, right? And I can tell it to, let's come over here. I can tell it to do priority. So priority is put it in my inventory. Uh, and let's do this. Let's go. Priority one is put it in the chest. 
Priority two is to export right here. So something like this. Let's swap back and forth. Here we go. There it is. And then back and forth, just like that. Nice, right? So that will take the stuff on and off. So there we go. I think that's been pretty good progress for the day. Got ourselves a drawer room and kind of a storage network already online. A little bit of power. It's actually not that expensive to run, right? 166,000. And, you know, I'll just chuck those guys in there. And 165, 980. So that costs 20 RF to make that transaction. Oh, don't want you to go in there. But I am going to have to make a ton more drawers. We are going to need a ton of cobblestone and iron and everything else. And so, you know, we're going to have to make some farms. But I really like having the beginning of a storage network. Got to make it a lot prettier, though. Uh, and I love, 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 now that I can do kind of a hot swap. Ooh, I can eat this. Ooh. Uh, did it do anything? No, it's just, let's see. What does this do? Plant on obsidian, creeper, chili crystals used to heal a tame. Oh, we can tame some of the creatures. I like that. I'm going to hold on to this dude. Uh, are you technically food? Uh, you'll go over here. And we can use this guy to go ahead and swap over. Ah, I got my hazmat suit on. I'm all full of air. And we can start going exploring outside. That's so nice. Plus, I can also get to some of the lava that I haven't been able to reach before. So, I think I'm going to call it here for today. I'm 47 Mark 4, and I hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, if you did, hey, you know, drop me a like, leave me a comment, let me know what you think about it, and then I will see you in the next episode.